हेलो एवरी वन आई होप यू लाइक द वीडियो ऑफ मार्पोल सेवेंटी थ्री सेवेंटी नाउ इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट एन एक्स फोर दट इज रेगुलेशन फॉर द प्रिवेंशन ऑफ पॉल्यूशन बाय सीवेज फ्रॉम शिप्स दिस एन एक्स फोर केम इन टू फोर्स ऑन ट्वेंटी सेवन सेप्टेम्बर टू थाउजेंड थ्री एंड रिवाइज एडिशन ऑफ दिस एन एक्स फोर वॉज एंटर इन टू फोर्स ऑन टू थाउजेंड फोर सो वॉट इज दिस सीवेज मीन्स ड्रेनेज एंड अदर वेस्ट फ्रॉम एनी फॉर्म ऑफ toilets and urines okay then drainage from medical premises via wash basins wash tubs and scuppers located in such premises then drainage from uh, from spaces containing living animals or other waste waters mixed with the drainage defined above okay so this is what sewage means according to the according to this annex 4 and this sewage is collected and stored in the tanks on ship known as holding tanks now the provisions of this annex apply to all ships greater than equal to 400 tons gross tonnage okay all ships greater than equal to 400 tons in gross tonnage and all ships certified to carry more than 15 persons okay the provisions of this ship applies to all the ships more than equals to 400 tons gross tonnage and to all the ships which are certified to carry more than 15 persons on board and according to this annex every ship comply with the regulations of this annex shall undergo an initial survey before the ships are put into service to ensure the following points so let's see about those points first is the ship is fitted with a sewage treatment plant okay which complies with the operational standards developed by the organizations okay the ships Should be fitted with a sewage treatment plant, which is uh, which is developed by the organizations. Then a system to comminute and disinfect the sewage of an approved type, and a holding tank. Okay, I had already told you about holding tank. Holding tank is a tank on ship used for the collection and storage of this sewage. So the capacity of which is sufficient to retain sewage having regard. To uh, to the operation of the ship, okay, operation of the ship, number of persons and other factors, okay, and the ship is fitted with a pipeline leading to the exterior and a standard discharge connection of the dimensions, okay, dimensions given in the regulation ten of this annex for the discharge of sewage to a shore reception facilities, okay. So we can say that these are the arrangement. about which a survey ensures that whether these arrangements are completed on ship or not before the ship is put into service and after the survey of those following arrangements a certificate is given to the ship known as international sewage pollution prevention certificate okay that is isppc okay uh, this certificate is valid for 5 years and subject to no alteration taking place in the material fitting equipment or arrangement except for direct replacement now let's see about special area according to annex 4 so according to this annex only the baltic sea area is the special area of this annex 4 now let's discuss about discharge criteria according to this annex for discharge of sewage so first point is the sewage is comminuted and disinfected using an approved system and discharged more than 3 miles from the nearest land or discharge more than 12 miles from the nearest land if not comminuted and disinfected or sewage from a holding tank should not be discharged instantaneously but at a moderate rate when the ship is en route and proceeding at speed more than equals to 4 knots the second point says that the ship has in operation an approved sewage treatment plant which we had already seen in the arrangements or requirements which has been certified and whose test results are laid down in the ispp certificate okay we had discussed about this previously and whose effluent does not produce visible floating solids okay does not produce visible floating solids or cause discoloration of the water okay then the ship is discharging sewage in the in a state where less stringent requirements are imposed fourth point is 
where sewage is mixed with waste waters having different discharge requirements okay where the sewage is mixed with waste waters different uh, different discharge requirements are there more stringent stringent requirements will apply okay there okay there more stringent requirements will apply so this was about annex 4 of marpol 7378 that is regulations for the prevention of pollution by sewage from ships so i hope you will like the video so please click the like button share the video and subscribe the channel thank you so much